Oh. We don't have any questions. He just wants people to know. Yeah. How has the competition level been here in the first couple of days of camp, and how good is it to get out here and just run? It's been really good. It's been physical. It's, uh, it's what training camp's supposed to be like. You know, us beating each other up a little bit. Uh, you know, I had four or five practices up to this point. Just getting after it, it was nice to finally be able to just scrimmage and play here. Um, so it's been good. I think guys are feeling a little bit. Tomorrow will be a good film and shooting day, but it's been a good three days. Ice bikes? For sure. Sure. Domas referenced both the offense and defense that has dramatically grown and gotten better. What have you seen from this team over the last few days? Yeah, just year two. Uh, I think everyone's trying to play the right way. I think that's that's really good to see. You know, the ball's moving. Um, you know, the the guys that we have new that are coming in are, are trying to fit in and they're trying to play the right way. So uh, it's good to see defensively. I think everyone's playing a lot of effort. Uh, again, it's training camp. That's that's usually what happens here. We just got to sustain it, continue to show it. We play Toronto. Um, but everyone's trying to do the right things. How do, how do you practice and endure physicality in the first week of camp? You just got to know what's coming. Uh, you know, it's a big emphasis from coaching staff every year. Uh, you come into camp and everyone's fighting for jobs, fighting for playing time, and beat each other up. It's physical, but you love it. You know that's just the game, and uh, it's definitely been intense the first three days. Can you give us a story of maybe it's just plays getting physical and nothing like that? You know, nothing like guys going at each other right. just within the game. Uh, you know, a lot of breakdown drills. We're doing four and four and uh, transition drills, and you know, not everything is as fluid as just scrimmaging. So a lot of half court stopping, trying to get our plays right, uh, and those types of things. They get physical. Well, what are you? Uh, what are your impressions of Sasha, and what, what does it look like is coming maybe easy to him, and what is he still adjusting to? Yeah, just the way we play. I think it's uh, the way we play really fits his game, and you know we knew that coming in, and uh, you know, he's still he's, he's shooting the ball well. He's playing the right way. Guys are finding him. You know, getting used to playing with him. Uh, he's a good. It was fun watching Davion up and, and chirping and talking a lot there during the scrimmage at the end. How have you seen him grow just as a, a point guard and a leader? Yeah, he is. He's talking a lot more, to be honest. He's uh, in a good way, though. He's, you know, his confidence has grown. I think he's had a great summer. Uh, played with him a couple times this summer and pick up in different cities. And uh, you know, He's bringing that here. I think it's, you know, it's a big year for him. I think he's really excited. He's worked extremely hard to be here. And uh, you know, him, him talking is, is usually what he does. But I think in general, you know, the coaches are pushing to talk more, and he is. What are your early impressions of how Duarte can impact this team? Both sides of the ball. You know, he's a, he's a physical defender. Um, he's a guy that can get up into the ball and, and pressure you right when you get over half court. And offensively, is a really you know, mature game. Uh, Scored all three levels. Uh, I think he's still getting used to how we're playing, and but he's going to be really good for us on both sides. Say, Kevin, uh, getting back to the physical part, are you seeing you know your teammates taking? Taking uh, hard screens and uh, going vertical, getting hit in the chest, uh, taking charges right now. Yeah, everything, everything. Uh, like I said, there's no, no one's playing dirty. No one's gotten into it. There hasn't been any of that. Just guys trying to be physical, play the right way, set the tone uh, for hopefully we can play the rest of the year. I know the team has goals for preseason games, but for you personally, what are you looking for out of the the four preseason games that you play before the se season starts? Just continue to establish what we do. Uh, continue to get comfortable with each other, you know, within our offense. Continue to get in shape. Uh, establish what we what we want to do defensively, and you know, just be at a point where we can hit the ground running for for game one. Based Ever been on to Vancouver, have not first time. You, I mean, I know you don't get a whole lot of time to spend there, but how much do you? Like, I know what used to be an NBA market, but obviously not anymore. How much do you like going to those places like that? Yeah, I'm interested. I love traveling. Uh, to be honest, I really don't know much of anything about Vancouver, um, so I'm excited. It's a new place, new adventure. I'm not going to be there very long, unfortunately, yeah. but uh, maybe get some dinner, see the city a little bit. Based on what you're seeing, Kevin, what is a realistic expectation of, of the, the defensive improvement this team could make this year? It's tough to tell. Uh, tough to tell yet. You know, we still got it. You got to do it in a game. Um, but I know that you know the effort's there so far in camp. Again, we just keep going back to guys trying to play more physical, being in the right spots, taking charges, being there for teammates, and just got to sustain it. What in the world is happening to your New York Giants? <laughs> that is a, that's a sense of so that man the Yankees. Uh, as you can see, I've been very quiet on Twitter, trying to keep my mouth shut. But it's been tough to watch so far. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Thanks guys. Thank you.